What's up guys, Brad here, Brews on Review, back with another beer review. Third of the night, which is rare, I don't do that. I usually do one a night if I'm gonna do beer reviews, because I don't. My palate, man, a couple beers, two, three beers, well not three, three, four beers, I'll be, can't taste really fuck all, so I usually just do one, especially if I'm drinking something special, like I know it's gonna be a special beer, man. First beer and only, one for the night for reviews, but the first one tonight I didn't really drink. The second one was like a 5% lager. The third one, another 5% lager. So, we're still firing on all cylinders. <laughs> okay, Whistler Brewing Company again, like I said, BC, here in Canada, 5% ABV, Bear Paw Honey Lager. And I've seen a lot of bears on these Canadian labels. I like our bears. Anyway, let's pour this one. It's good, we'll do a side by side then kind of almost. Kind of almost, I just drank their other lager a few minutes ago, so. This one already looks better to me, just nice, a lot darker orange, or like a light golden color. Kind of that same fizzy, this one is an off-white head with that fizzy kind of soapy looking head to it. Let's check out the aroma. Wow, it smells really close to the last one minus uh, what I call that corn aroma. That's not really there and maybe just like a more subtle sweetness which is probably from the brewer's honey also giving it a little different color but I'm guessing damn near the same beer recipe yeah you can you can almost tell like I've done that with my home brews where you kind of use your staple base recipe I mean this or what do they call that horizontals verticals verticals I don't know I can't remember which one it is but I think that's what they're doing with this lager switching out one ingredient for a different one but still smells pretty decent beer it's like non-offensive smells pretty good kind of that weedy light malt light corn kind of a touch of honey aroma let's get into it hmm hmm packing a better flavor though yeah, absolutely. A little bit better mouthfeel on it too than the uh, Lost Powder Mountain Lager. Is that what it was? I think. Yeah, but I mean, it's still, it's not like a mind blowing beer, but it's still really an enjoyable beer. Hmm. Yeah. Get that like uh, light to medium mouthfeel. A little more creamy than the last one. Maybe get a little more of that sweetness from the honey. Really a simple beer, but uh, pretty done. It, pretty, it's done well. It's a nice beer, and man, definitely a good gateway beer. I remember buying this kit like a couple years ago, maybe longer, a little longer. I'm not sure, but. I, mean, I fell in love with these beers. Lemon Tree, a bunch of these ones that kind of get you, get you into the whole scene. But that's yeah, a good little beer. For a rating, let's uh, jump in there. I, got, I already knew, man. I'm going to give this one a 70. It's a little bit better than the other lager, and it's a pretty decent little beer, so. Yeah. What can I say? Except cheers guys, thanks for watching, appreciate it, till next time.